and queens welcome back to another video it's been like four or five weeks since i last posted stupid i'm not gonna let you get the chance <laughs> guys it has oh i tried to put it behind my ear and it still decided to come out i don't know what was going on with me but i was having a little i was having a little hair mount function i'm still kind of having one Guys, it has been like five weeks since I last posted, and I'm going to tell y'all why. So, I don't live at home anymore. As you can see, this is not my house. I'm in college now. I'm in college. I'm currently in week four of doing my work, and I feel like it's pretty easy. I'm going to just give up laughing. Me too. I've been in school for the last four weeks. I have three zooms a week and they're pretty easy to keep up with so for all the people that say college is hard i know we probably haven't really gotten to the, the deep deep part but as of now it's pretty it's pretty swifty it's, it's going pretty well so in today's video i'm doing highly requested everyone wanted to see what my dorm looks like this is not a full dorm tour because my roommate here she's not ready yeah she's not ready with her side yet we've been We've been really struggling. I actually just did my struggling. whole side yesterday. Struggling, struggling. I actually did my whole side yesterday. So this is gonna be like a half room tour, but um, it's okay. So I hope you guys enjoy my dorm. This is gonna be, I'm gonna title it unfinished dorm tour because I feel like there's gonna be a lot more stuff if we actually stay here a long time. We're actually gonna go in and do a lot more to it to make it look more homey because it's home. But like, it's not. It's not at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> so let's get into it. This is our door. As you see, it just has escape routes. But when you look over at my roommate's door, these are like our little house rules. Super cute that we DIY'd. Then this is my closet, which I got the Ivies from Amazon. I can put the link below in the description box if you want to get your own Ivies too. Then this is my bath towel, and when you open up my closet, this is my closet. So on my door, I have this shoe organizer where I keep um, majority of my shoes that fit. And then this is where I hang up all of my hoodies and jackets, my laundry basket and extra shoes are down there. Then I have my bin for my snacks and other goods. And then I got this little light from Walmart. And this is just all the things that are in my bin right now. Then this is the top. I know it probably looks really unorganized, but it's full of just my camera gear, my iron, my hat, a suitcase, and plastic bags. So that's it for the closet. This is my bed area. So this wall I actually DIY'd yesterday um, before filming this, but it's more Ivy's from the closet. And then these are all pictures that I took from Pinterest. I printed them out um, downstairs in the dorm and just kind of put them together with a collage theme in mind. If you have more pictures that you think I should put up here, make sure you DM them to me on Instagram because I would love to add to this wall. But the aesthetic is blue, which I really, really love. And then this is my filming wall for when I do my makeup videos, which took me a long time to hang up. And then my bed aesthetic is, of course, gray, because that is one of my favorite subtle colors. The throw is from Five Below. Then that is my drawer where I keep my towels and toiletry things. Then they give us this little drawer where I just keep my makeup and quick to grab things, along with my medicines and, you know, the essentials. 
I keep a trunk in front of my bed so I can hop up on my bed easily because it's high. But in my trunk, I just have extra masks. Then I have a lot of clothes that didn't fit, like my sweatpants, some towels, and then some toiletries. Then there's a shelf right in front of my bed where my desk is and there I just keep my lotion, makeup brushes, of course my favorite candy because I have a problem, my makeup and my tissue box. And then behind there is where I keep my weekly homework checklist of things that I need to do. Then up under that I keep my water and my additional juice boxes along with the trash can. Then right next to that, I keep my mirror, my calendar for the week, and then of course my collection of post-it notes. This little strip of wallpaper we were gonna put around the whole room, but we ran out and it didn't really stick that well, so yeah. My post-it notes just keep me reminded of what I need to do eventually and just boost my self-esteem. And then of course my collection of masks and my key for the room and the bathroom. Don't forget to apply for your voting ballot and register to vote. So this is my desk, probably my favorite part of the entire room because it comes together so perfectly with my aesthetic. Um, I have all of my little notes and things that I need sticking on there and I just love how organized I keep it so far. This sign I actually made, the wood is from Target, which I can put the link in the bio, but this little leaf is from Five Below along with this plant from Five Below as well. Then I have this little organization bin. The top is where I just keep little push pins, safety pins. This one is where I keep more markers for my board. And this one is the health part. That's just my checklist of things I need to do in the day. Then you move over to a shared space between me and my roommate, which is our fridge and microwave. So the fridge, the top shelf is hers, and then the second shelf just, you know, food. Then the top, we just have a lot of greens and waffles, strawberries, and turkey dogs. This is another shared space, our little entertainment section. We play a lot of video games, so there's GameCubes and Wii my speaker, and then board games like Guess Who, you know, we got Cards Against Humanity, and of course, a Bop It, because why not? Then under that is where we keep a lot of the dishes. We don't really use them yet because we don't really like to wash in the sink in the bathroom. And then the bottom, the plastic where I actually bought this cute mini blender to put my frozen strawberries in to make little smoothies, which I haven't used yet, but I'm excited. A little grill that we also haven't used our sponges, and then a toaster in which I use frequently when I make my waffles. And then our LED lights, um, we love them at night. They're the perfect aesthetic before going to bed or listening to music and having a little mini concert on the TV. Then right next to that, we keep a step stool and a bin full of our blankets. This is our window view. Our view is of a building next to the stadium. And of course we have AC and also radiators, which is good. So this is the room tour. I hope you enjoyed it. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed my dorm tour. If you did, give this video a big old thumbs up. Comment down below other things that we should add to the room to make it look better. Anything that you think will match the aesthetic. I guess my wall, the aesthetic is blue. So if you guys have any pictures from Pinterest or anything that should hang on my wall, make sure you DM them to me on my Instagram at CRXAndrea. Follow my TikTok at CRX Andrea on the road to 300K. We just hit like 207K. Um, so that's cool. And also subscribe to the channel if you want to become a king or a queen because I'm posting a new makeup video probably the week after this one's being posted. So you'll get to see the highly requested natural makeup because I can't believe I've never done a video with that. This is your first video. I'll see you guys later. Bye.